but if you uh, want, you could just slide that part up into my section, and I when I am working on it today, I can make it flow. Does somebody yeah. want? To do you want me to share the screen so we can like all look at it? Yeah, uh, that's I'm looking at mine right now. Okay. Um. How many pages was we required or was there a requirement four, on it? Four to five four single to five. spaced. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we're, we're there. We've got well more than enough content on here already. Mm -hmm. um, Cody, I felt like you too. I need to probably scrub some of my, my work that I did in mine. I, I, once I got done, I felt like I might've got a little wordy on some of the stuff and, and added too much. So if I, I need to, I, I guess when we get um, Victoria's, I wouldn't, for myself, I'll probably proofread it. And then yeah. maybe maybe we can do it, proofread each one and make highlights to what we think we can either adjust or mm -hmm. move. Um, what are we, we're about seven, six, seven pages now. Well, I thought we were right at four pages, single space. Yeah, we don't count the... Yeah, we don't cover page okay. or the reference pages or any of the extra like figures yes mm -hmm. so we're right at four pages but we still have you know one more section to add so right we should be in a good spot we're right on target yeah i like the contact i think we uh um what i've seen from jenny's and cody's um what you guys have cited there's there's good information we've provided a lot of good information for professor to look at but I think Cody's right. We just need to make sure it flows. Yeah. As a as a paper. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and maybe, you know, do you guys have any ideas for me then? As far as like the tools and apps, so I guess I spent like the bulk of it talking about what the platform can do. And I did touch a little bit on some third party tools, and that's the part I was planning on on bulking up some more. I mean, do you have some? You know, I don't know. I guess I'm just wondering. Do you guys have any ideas of like other tools and apps we can put in there? So um, what were the bullet points underneath like the requirements for that section? Do you remember on that? Um, I don't. So I guess maybe I need, to, I need to look back at the rubric. So I guess I'm going to pull that up real quick. Okay. And then once I get it up, I'll share my screen. Okay. Thank you. I just need to, to find it and how he. Because I know he listed like specific things he wanted. Because I know when I wrote like my sections, that's what I was like going off of. Okay. Um, so I was curious what that said, because that might help guide us a little bit. Yeah, that makes sense. Which one were you looking at? Tools and apps? Mm -hmm. It's loading, hang on. <laughs> You know what, Cody, I'm kind of like overviewing it right now. I I think you're explaining it fairly I, I in detail of what you can what you can do out there as far as the engagement and, and the things that um, business can offer. So I, I'll, I'll dig into it a little deeper, but I think you're right on pace on what we should what we could have. Perfect. Yeah, I just wonder. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I have it pulled up. Yeah. On my platform, some wrong guy. Okay. So, what about for like um, that nuts and bolts, or like the what's this, the one after the introduction? Uh, the platform. Um, platform, yeah, description, platform description. Yeah. Description. Tools and applications and assist because I guess. Well, I guess I, I maybe half of that first paragraph kind of more falls under here's what the platform can do versus, I don't know. So maybe we don't need to touch more on like tools like the analytics you can do with Facebook. And that, I guess I just don't know like where the line is for those. 
you know. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. um, let me pull up the paper again real quick on my other side. The only, th I don't remember if you had Messenger in your tools. Uh, I, I touched on it really briefly. I would say add more to that. Mm -hmm. So I know okay. a lot of businesses, if they have a Facebook page, you can message them and mm -hmm. someone is like, that's their job to message back. Oh, yeah. yeah. And I think some people use like, uh, is it WeChat or one of those tools too? About, so you can actually operate like a phone number through your business Facebook page. Did you talk having about, a landline? Yeah. Did you talk about Facebook Live? Because I know a lot of businesses are doing like those live oh, events. Point two. Let, me, let me put these down in my section so I can fill those out. That's what that one of my uh, um, the one well Jenny the one that you seen with Ford Motor Company that's what they did yeah with, and I I used it in, in my my section um, and they did it pretty much on Facebook Live yeah I think Facebook Live is really big for a lot of small businesses yeah because. What other tools are in Facebook? Um, I would say Messenger and Facebook Live are probably the two biggest ones that I. Uh, and I think I could counter. probably touch more on analytics or even like, I guess you could probably, because like, I think Google Sites, or not Google Sites, like, I think you can do like Google Analytics for like any given website. So I wonder if that's useful for Facebook too. So I think Facebook offers some analytics, but I guess what I was looking at, I wasn't clear if it was offered directly by Facebook or if it was a third party thing. Mm -hmm. okay. I know this isn't a tool, but like a private and public page might be like a way they can use it as a tool, like private for only employees and public for everyone else. Oh, That's yeah. not really a tool, but you can kind of, yeah, that kind of angle as a tool, like yeah. how they use the pages. So I don't think we should make this harder than it needs to be. Because like, if you look at the example paper, it's not super detailed. Did you, did you read that paper that yeah. was listed out there? Mm -hmm. And like on the tools and apps, like I'm looking at the rubric he gave us in class, the, that section's worth five points. <laughs> <laughs> out of the right, well. So if that helps. Okay. <laughs> so yeah. I think if you touch on two or three things, you know, and write a little detail, you know, a couple, two or three sentences on each one. I yeah. think you're good. Okay. Um, I wouldn't stress about that. Where did you find the, like the rubric or like the, the bullet description of each portion? Oh. It's at the top um, of the class Thanks. page where it says like social media project. Did you find it? Um, I'm, I, is that the one with like, there's multiple pages? There it is. Okay. Yeah. I yeah. Found it. And then go to the okay. report page. Got it. Mechanic. See, so nuts and bolts covers the structure and mechanics of the platform. Basically types of pages. Like, yeah. So I guess you could really, Victoria, you could probably take a lot. You could probably take it. I mean, at least half of that, the first paragraph I wrote for like the types of pages that could be created. So okay. I think I would definitely move that over to your section and use that as a starting point. And then I'll kind of just add, add a couple of these things um, that we've been talking about. Cause there's a link that I've been doing a lot of writing notes on cause I can't write notes on a link for commenting on it, mm -hmm. but about how to make the page, how to get the audience and kind of. Yeah. I ended up. Get. ended up making a page for my podcast and that's how I wrote most of that paragraph because I was like <laughs> oh hey I can do all this stuff that's cool I didn't know that and that's cool that's, that's how I ended up doing that so oh, that's a that's I a think, good idea I think between between that resource you have and and what I wrote from that I think will be pretty
set on that. Yeah. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Sorry. <laughs> no, you're fine. I mean, I, I should have read a little more detail about that nuts and bolts. I think I did just kind of read. I skimmed that Twitter paper and then just went based off of that, I think. So. I definitely think we're covering everything he's asking for. So I think Agree. we'll be good. Um, what do you think about our wiki site? Do you think we need to do anything else to it? Don't we, um, he, he's very good at giving feedback. Um, do you want to just send him a quick uh, email and just ask, hey, is there anything that we, we, we need to do? And I'm sure he'll provide it. Sure. I know um, the links page, I'll need to add more to it. You need whatever links we use. We have to add that to the page and add a description of why we used it, like bullet pointed. Mm -hmm. So I stopped adding all the links in case we don't use them all. But whatever links we do use, if you bold it in the links page, I'll add it. And I'll add a little description box and I'll let you guys know when it's done. So if you want to go in and say, hey, this is why I use this at this link. And just kind of make bullet points of it. Then the links page will. I think it sounded like quickly. he was going to take a look at it this week, and mm -hmm. and but I. This this is like the second class we've done something, and and it feels like they're not really paying much attention to it. <laughs> you know, we we do one project, and then all of a sudden it's like, where to go? Yeah. But, no, I think we're on good pace. I was excited about not having school the last week too. Yeah. And all our assignments turned in. That's nice. That's very nice. Yeah. When do we what and what's our what's our plan to submit? Are we gonna submit this to the um the writing center? Or what was we talking about? I don't think it's a bad idea just to look at APA citations and references and make sure it has flow. Okay. I don't know. I've never used the writing center before, so it'd be a good good practice to see how what 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 we get out of it. Mm -hmm. Um it'll only like one person will have to probably do it. Okay. I would think that we probably need to submit by Tuesday or Wednesday of this week. Right. Give them enough time. Mm -hmm. then it if takes, we... um, I think I used it like in our first, um, in the last class for the big uh -huh. paper. And it mm. takes them, um, gosh, it took them like, I don't know, three or four days or so. Like I would say at least three days to get back to me. It seemed like it was around three days. Okay. And they don't do it really over the weekend. So it's like three business days. So I think we could have everything ready to submit by Monday or Tuesday then. So if we had any corrections or anything we need to do, we could do them next weekend and then turn submit our paper. Mm -hmm. Is everybody good with that? Yeah, I can get my stuff done by tonight. So Monday morning, I'm it should my part should be all done. Okay. And like I said, I, I'm I'm like Cody too. I'm gonna I gotta go through mine. Probably not today, probably tomorrow to try to clean up, reword, or, you know, just uh, make sure it goes a little better and mine might be ready Monday morning. Okay. I don't mind sending the paper off unless someone else wants to. That'd be great. Thank okay, you. then yeah, I'll do that Monday morning. It might be helpful to send um, like the, that page that says single space, those like copy those directions. That I'll send the directions and the rubric with it. So they kind of have some yeah. background. <laughs> Cause they're gonna kind of probably reply back, um, you know, that it's not double spaced, like all the oh, yeah. APA formatting. Mm -hmm. So if I download it from docs to word, will it mess up any of the formatting? 
that's the tricky part. I don't know. Cause I don't usually use Google um, docs to write papers. Okay, neither do I. So I didn't know if it would I have to download it and make sure it's formatted how we want it to turn it in. Mm -hmm. How did all, do we submit all this or cause I, or does he just look at our, since he has access? I think he looks at it. Okay. So yeah, I'm not sure. I, I was I was thinking we submitted it, but he could just look at it. Because how do you submit it? How do you submit a wiki page? Oh, that's true. I don't know. I'm just curious. I don't know much about this. I would think since he has access, that's might be a question for class. Okay. Yeah. I feel like you may have answered it, but I, I can't remember one way or the other what yeah, you said. I don't know, because then he would be getting four submissions of the same thing. Yeah. And he did say it's only one. Mm -hmm. We submitted only once. Yeah. Or one person emails him saying, hey, we want to submit our stuff. And then he just looks at it. So I wonder if that's yeah. the submission, like we're completed. Like, mm -hmm. yeah, I don't know. I wrote that down to ask him. All right. Is there anything you need that I should like review in my sections to add or that anybody? I don't, I didn't, I didn't see anything. I just think that, you know, for myself is I submitted mine yesterday. So I need to, you know, make sure I was cleaned up a little bit. Mm -hmm. I, I don't write scholarly. I write informal. So I write like I talk a lot of times. I got to kind of go back and clean it up. <laughs> okay. All right. We all good? I think, yeah. Is there anything else? Do we need to meet again next Saturday, do you think? I think so, because I think if we paper back, we can we can kind of bounce some ideas off and yeah. just finish it up. I'm I'm good with uh, eight o'clock, gets my weekend started. I'm just gonna double check volleyball time, sorry. Oh yeah. Make sure you don't have volleyball. I know. <laughs> did you hear the high school's not letting anybody in to watch? I did, Z zero patrons. I know we have we have two seniors and a junior. We can't go watch this stuff this winter. Nope, we're good. So that's good. Yeah. Just a side hey. note: I graduate technically on Saturday, next Saturday. Oh really? Oh really? It's my ceremony that they got canceled in May. Then now it's online, so I have my oh, graduation. Cool. Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> Well, that's exciting. Yeah, but that one was at the eight o'clock meeting. I just wanted to share. I'm excited. Yeah. Yeah. I wish so you could walk across the stage. Yeah, that's a big deal. Yeah. Oh, I know. I'm I'm really bummed about that. Like, you don't need to buy a cap and gown. I'm like, I already have. I was graduating in May. I have my cap and gown. I'll wear it in my front room if I need to. <laughs> <laughs> well, good for you. Yeah. <laughs> Phew, that's exciting. Well, thank you. Are you feeling better, Cody, or feeling okay? Um, I'm feeling a little better. It's it's just taken forever, basically. I'm I'm getting a little bit better, but my COVID test came back negative, so that's something. So that's good. Probably just the flu, I guess. I don't know, but been a little drawn out. But yeah, if my symptoms clear this weekend, I should be okay to come to class. But otherwise, I'll just be you know never be in that classroom again. I guess where yeah, you guys. So I don't know. We'll see. I'm feeling a little, I mean, even this morning, I guess I'm feeling a little better. So well, that's good. good. Yeah. Thanks for good. We are worried about you. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, what night, what, what's our next class after break? Does anybody know? Mm, that's a good question. It's organization, is it organizational leadership with that, um, Yorton, that guy we met? Oh. I'm pretty sure that's one of our last ones we have. Oh, is it? I don't know why I was thinking. Um, here, let me pull it up. I have it saved to my computer. You know, you're right. It's the organizational leadership. I thought it was one of the last ones for some reason, but yeah. 
What day do we start back? What's the day of that? It is, here. I'll just share my screen, hang on. Um, we can all see it. It starts January 7th to the 25th of February. It, is it in the same room where we're at now? Yeah, they're all in the same yeah. room. Oh, they're all in that same room. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hmm. All right. So what do we got organizational and then accounting and finance? Oh, that's going to be. That's going to, if we can make it through that one, that's, that's the one I'm least looking forward to. Yeah. So are you in our cohort now, Cody, or are you just kind of in and then going somewhere no, else? No, it was just this, just this class. So yeah, it's just this class? Yeah, so in cool. January, I start like the, the grad studies, that like intro course. Oh. And yeah, so I start a different cohort with a different, which well, would, whatever is cohort only. This class and have a break then. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, that's, that's kind of disappointing. I was hoping I you're going to be to the finish with us. Yeah, I liked the group. It was it's I know. too bad. I hope, I hope there's a good group on the next one. <laughs> yeah. Was so Stephanie going to be in your cohort then too? I don't know. I'm not sure. I think uh, Stephanie took uh, that graduate studies online. Mm. If, I'm, if I'm not mistaken, she might have had that online and then she, she jumped into ours. Okay. Yeah, so. So is she doing like a hybrid, I wonder, where she kind of goes back and forth between online and in class? I, I think so. And, and to be honest, I, that's when I, when I started mine, that's what I wanted to do mm -hmm. is I was, I was going to just take everything that was online, online and then come to the class. But I think I'm going to stick with the class. I, me and Victoria were in the, in the, the summer ones and I, I didn't really, I, it was okay, Victoria, what would you think? But I didn't really enjoy I didn't learn as much. I don't feel like I know I got the knowledge and got the concepts, but I feel like I learned more in person, taking the notes, asking the questions than being online. I do too. That's, that's how I felt. I didn't, I didn't feel like they were very, well, they were very unorganized because COVID hit and they didn't realize they were going to do online. So both the teachers wasn't prepared. I don't think. Oh, yeah. And then do you guys have this document? Somewhere, yeah. Okay. Do you have it, Mike? I, I have it, but theirs is actually different than ours, Victoria, because we, we're not going the summer. Yeah. Well, I know we're yes, technically right. MSM 18. <laughs> that doesn't exist. Uh -huh. We're technically 18, but. Yeah. I know. It, it may just be like Austin, me, and... Um, Marie, like the four of us this summer. I don't know. I know. Yeah. Yeah. So. Small group. <laughs> no. Victoria says she's going to take a class ahead. I don't know if she's going to do it. I might. I'm leaning towards not. Uh, I really like I the cohort. Too. So I'm like, I don't want to just skip over the <laughs> my break and then join another cohort for the last part of the the program. Because I'm like, <laughs> I like you guys. I <laughs> all want to stay. <laughs> That's what I was always wanting to do is just go ahead and stay with the cohort and then all just graduate together. Mm -hmm. So, so when's your finish time, Cody? Uh, it'll be August, 2022. I think it's the last August class. Yeah. It's kind of awkward. Cause I think I start, I have like two classes, like January, February, March, and I think April, May, I don't have any classes. There's just like a blank. Yeah. It, there's like a six week period where like, oh, there's probably should be a class here or an eight week period, but there isn't. Um, and I don't know if that's like the MBA people are taking a class. And then anyway, from then on out, then like from the summer out, I just keep going until August 2022. Oh, okay. and, yeah. Okay. Hmm. And so it'll just be a few months apart, I guess. You're yep. probably, I think that break is probably this class. The technology Oh, because I already did this one. Yeah, because that would make a lot would, of sense. That, that was like is, your second or third class. This is our so we had like that two week course and then a six week course and then this one. Interesting. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. I bet you're right. I think you're right. I think you're absolutely right. I uh, built in a little break for myself. I guess. A nine week <laughs> class with Thanksgiving, so Interesting. you have nine weeks to do an eight not have class. Mm -hmm. One thing um, I'm I'm worried about is is a 
and I think me and Victoria talked about it is stopping and then starting back <laughs> up. I don't know. I think I'm a little worried about because like after um oh we're running out of time here. Um in 10 minutes. So um Zoom gave me that flash. That's so funny. <laughs> um because I don't have a break at all after we go back for Chris from spring break. Like yeah. there's mm -hmm. no break until next Thanksgiving. Yeah. For me. Yeah. Which is a lot, I think. Like there's not yeah. a week off. It's, I had a it's friend. Hard. It's hard to look at that schedule and, and and you almost just gotta every cohort, every every module, you just gotta take them one at a time and then when yeah. you get done, you check that off and move. Yep. That's like, how it was when I was in the AOL program. We was went it? Um, yeah, I think we went 13 months straight and finished it, but I was like, I was spent. 